people aware that, you know, firefighters are out there. We're getting cancer from running into the burning buildings. Firefighters are 25% more likely to get cancer than any other profession. Mm -hmm. According to the group Neighbors United, four years ago, cancer became the number one killer of firefighters. Good evening. I'm Ann Emmerich. And I'm David Andrews. Firefighters putting their lives on the line beyond just fighting fires. News 10's Jordan Burrell spoke to a Lansing Fire Department chief who is now spreading cancer awareness after battling the disease herself. Jordan? I spoke to Lisa Konishnik, a battalion chief for Lansing Fire Department, who is one of many recipients of last year's funds for firefighters battling cancer. Now she is working alongside Neighbors United to spread awareness and to help those who help us every day. As those who help others, it is very hard to ask for help. Um, that was actually one thing that was kind of a struggle because you know, we don't ask for help. <laughs> Lisa Kenishnik has worked for the Lansing Fire Department for over 21 years. I always knew I wanted to help people. However, in 2021, Kenishnik was on the receiving end. She began fighting a battle that she couldn't fight alone. The day before Thanksgiving. And I'll never forget that. She was diagnosed with breast cancer after waiting six months for a diagnosis. Throughout my chemo, I had several complications. And while going through chemo, then they thought I had had colon cancer on top of it. Um, luckily, it ends up I did not have that, but I had to have several surgeries. I had my colon removed, and then I also had to have breast surgery um, to remove the cancer along with chemotherapy and radiation. Now Lisa is in remission and has returned to work at the Lansing Fire Department, accepting a new promotion as battalion chief. Every day is a new day. And that was something that I had to live by. It was every bad day, I'm like, tomorrow's a new day. And today she is working to spread awareness. Lisa and her family, along with members of Neighbors United, will be walking 140 miles for the Walk for the Red fundraiser. There's so many people that aren't aware of the amount of cancer or the firefighters with cancer. Um, right now, it's 61% of firefighter line of duty deaths are from cancer. And that's a significant increase from what we're used to. The walk kicks off tomorrow starting at the Macomb Fire Department and ends near Grand Rapids. The walk will make its stop in Lansing on Saturday morning. Neighbors United encouraging people to join them. The organization is still raising money for the firefighters and we will have that link within this story on our website at WILX.com.